Here, for example, is Carrie Lake's response in June when a CNN reporter asked her for an interview. Watch this. Hi, Yuri. Hi. Hi. Nice to see you. Can I walk and see you don't have a mask on anymore. What's we're, going we're on? Outside. Do you have a wow. minute to well, chat? Well, we're six feet apart. <laughs> do you have a minute to chat? Um, I'll do an interview. Okay. As long as it airs on CNN+. Plus. Oh. Does that still exist? <laughs> yeah. I didn't think so, because the people don't like what you guys are peddling, so, which is propaganda. Thank do you. you. Do you- <laughs> Where's your mask, you neurotic freak? I'll do it on CNN Plus. Oh, that failed because everyone hates you. (laughs) It's so great because it's so true. All of us know it. But the people in charge, especially in the Republican Party, never admit it out loud. If the New York Times did a hit piece on Mitch McConnell, he'd be rushing around his office worried about it. The New York Times is a hit piece on Carrie Lake every day, and she laughs because it doesn't matter what the New York Times thinks. They only have power because we give them power because we treat them like they're real, but they're fake. They're ghosts. Turn on the lights and they evaporate. They go away. They don't actually exist.